Happening today, a dive team plans to return to a South Columbus quarry where a man was spotted struggling in the water. Crews searched on the ground and in the air last night, but ran into darkness and couldn't locate that victim. This is the area they're focused on. It's behind the Great Southern Shopping Center on South High Street. And 10 TV's Tina Ramos is live at that location with what's happening right now. You know. Yeah, we're waiting for the assembly to start taking place here because we do have daylight now that we're hoping that within the daylight time they'll actually be able to see where this person, if they have a drowning victim at all. Matter of fact, it's right behind me, right behind the tree line. I have some video I want to show you to show you exactly the quarry that we're talking about here. You're right. It's between High Street in the southern part of Columbus and Jackson Pike. There's a group of quarries that are back there. It was around six o'clock last night when a witness actually called police telling them that they saw a man in the water. He was yelling. He was screaming and at that point even witnessed him possibly going under but then lost track of the man. Now Columbus crews came out here including they brought out helicopters to search from the air and they were also searching the ground area to see if indeed they could find the person. No luck. They searched for about two hours until the daylight ran out and at that point that's when they suspended that search waiting for daylight today to possibly come up here to begin the search again. So we're just kind of waiting on the crews right now to enter back into the water. They will bring dive teams in here to search to see if indeed they will find somebody. We can tell you at this point, police say they have not had any reports of anybody missing. So indeed, we're still trying to figure out if indeed this is a drowning. Of course, we'll keep you posted. In South Columbus, Tino Ramos, 10TV News.